took Shirley and left with someone. Why didn't you stop him? Stop him? You know him better than I do. <clears throat> so who exactly was it? The heirs of Ida. They claim that they can save Shirley. For Zeke, the choice was clear as day. Heirs of Ida. The crazy bunch that tried to overthrow Hycros? How did they get mixed into this? Zeke is hiding something, isn't he? Hmm. You found something, didn't you? I found some of Zeke's things that may connect the dots. I left them on the table over there. I can see it. Your sorrow. Your sadness. Your weakness. I can see all your self-pity. Cursing your cruel fate. But Calamity is not without hope. The root of the curse has long been buried. It is etched deep within your bones. Inundated in flesh and blood. You have all forgotten how the world used to be. You have all forgotten. This world belonged to humanity. But mortals are puppets of desire. They raised the Tower of Fantasy, grasping at Omnium from above. How grand, how ridiculous. Those on the ground cower in the shadows, while the pestilential aberration runs rampant. And the fools behind this sit high above in Hycros in their foolish attempt to rebuild a new order that is merely a trap. And the rest of humanity are but flies. Lost lambs, have you sincerely repented? When will the savior you call for arrive? Knock hard at the gates of fate. The fertile soil will be sowed with your own hands. Heirs of Ida, there is no need to mourn the dead. The gates of heaven are never closed. I will witness every sacrifice with my own eyes. They will bring about a new order. And this world will be reborn from ashes. No doubt that person in the video is the mysterious sage. Looks like Zeke had been in contact with the heirs of Ida for a while now. The two kids are Zeke and Shirley. Their parents were members of the heirs of Ida. What? Why hasn't Zeke mentioned this before? He probably just wanted a normal life. After witnessing what happened to their parents, I'm sure Zeke wouldn't want Shirley and himself to share a similar fate. But now, Shirley's become the heirs of Ida's greatest bargaining chip. They want Zeke, and Zeke would do anything to save his sister. Could the heirs of Ida be behind the Ravager's attack? I can't say for sure, but I know that they're willing to do anything it takes to achieve their goal. We must get Zeke back. We can't let him be a pawn of those lunatics. Leave it to me. I'll find Zeke. The heirs of Ida are not to be taken lightly. You don't have to do this. They saved my life. I'm only returning the favor. Enthusiasm alone can't find Zeke. If you need help, you can start with the Chrono Chamber mentioned in the lab journal. It was one of the secret facilities built by Hykros half a century ago. 
The ruins outside the shelter is another. It was abandoned after the cataclysm. Who knows what's down there? If you're going in, be careful. I'm going to Hykros and inform them of everything that happened here. Maybe they can help. Anyway, I'll see you. Mia overheard your conversation. Will you really be able to bring Shirley and Zeke back? Mia can sense the internal emotional circuits surging. <laughs> Shirley and Zeke are important companions. Alas, I am a malfunctioning smart servant, but if I may be of assistance in any way, please take me with you. All right, let's go and come home together, all four of us. I found a slumbering smart servant. Master, you have finally returned. Apologies, it appears my identification system is malfunctioning. Identity verified. First generation smart servant. B -b -b Peanut. Greetings. I am waiting for my master. My master left me here to await his return while Ida conducted the second regression. This is day 17,682 since his departure. Log, day 17,682. Approximately 48 years ago. Where is your master? That information is protected under the Retrospect Project Protocol. My apologies. Preliminary inspection suggests you are in need of maintenance. Failure to do so will result in... Thank you for your concern, but I shall stay here and wait. If you are intent on entering the Chrono Chamber, please be careful. I have detected prominent signs of aberration within. Creator left a relic here. I hope it will be of some help to you. Mew. Entering hibernation mode. Hmm. Is this place the Chrono Chamber you mentioned? What does it actually do? Peanut has entered hibernation mode. It cannot provide more information. be dangerous inside. Wait for me by the entrance. Affirmative. Please stay s safe. Hyenas get in here. Oh. 
disappeared. The exit should be up there. Tower anomaly detected. Please investigate. Oh, we meet again. Paul? Franz? What happened here? What happened? As it seems, Someone's activated the tower beneath our feet. Normally, Hykros will only start channeling energy into this tower in winter, when the shelter's energy supply runs low. But today... Don't worry, Paul. It may just be a glitch or error in the distribution grid. That's simple? No, no, no. It's just my guess. 
I'll have to ask those old geriatrics about what actually happened, of course. Hmm. So it's Hykros again. I never bought into their whole saving the world spiel. Hmm. And that's why it's so hard for you to make friends, Paul. Hey, newbie, how about you go with Franz? Me? Truth be told, I don't trust him. Well, all right. We shall go to High Cross and get to the bottom of this. It's also a great chance to see the rest of the world. Celine still needs my help at the shelter, so we'll be waiting to hear back from you. Relax, Paul. I'll take care of our new friends here. I'll activate a space rift straight to High Cross, but it only allows one person to go through at a time. You go ahead. I'll be right behind you. Don't worry. I've sent word to the administrators at High Cross. They know you're coming. Unauthorized visitor detected. Halt, or you will be stopped by force. I come from Astra, and I'm here with Franz. Astra Shelter, area code HT501. Mia enters High Cross territory for the first time and engaging information exchange with other smart servants. Welcome, young one. I'm Klima, commander of the District 9 Executors. Franz informed us about why you came here. Unfortunately, we don't have much information about the abnormal energy flows of the Astra Omnium Tower. Everyone at the shelter is worried. Could it be a mechanical malfunction? The heirs of Ida tampered with the energy transmission program. It's causing the five Omnium Towers to send their stored energy back to the Central Tower. The Central Tower has a finite storage capacity. Exceeding it could dangerously overload the system. As a safety precaution, we had to vent excess energy to the surface at the cost of causing a certain degree of radiation damage. This is not a permanent solution. Franz submitted a report detailing that you triggered momentary space-time distortions during combat. Is that true? Yes. Time would sometimes flow extremely slowly around me. We call this phenomenon Fantasia. It's a human-generated temporal distortion in a localized area. It's usually an ability only exhibited by executors. The Executor Order is an elite unit formed to handle all forms of Omnium disasters. Its members are genetically augmented to possess a certain degree of control over the time dimension. I found info related to you in the Executor Order's database dated half a year back. You and your squad went MIA during an operation. I... I was an Executor? Indeed. However, we still don't know what happened to you during the last six months. But as you can see, we're facing many difficulties. The heirs of Ida are planning something, and the issues with the Omnium Towers need to be resolved urgently. Hykros has limited manpower in District 9 currently. We need your help in dealing with the heirs of Ida. I have reported your situation to Archon Elric in District 9. You should go see him. Welcome to Hykros. I'm Elric, Archon of District 9. Greetings, Archon Elric. Captain Klima has informed me of your situation. I'm delighted to see the return of one of our steed executors. Franz said that you lost all your memories upon your rescue. Is that so? Yes. I can't remember anything that happened before then. 
The report also mentions that you possess excellent combat skills. It looks like you have retained your past training and skills. Which is to say, you can still perform your duties as an executor. I have no doubt. However, a full inspection is still required before you return to active duty. We will log your data and upgrade your suppressor with the latest modules. Understood. I am ready. Are you ready? Getting along fine. Franz? Are you okay? Me? <laughs> I'm... great. How have these geezers been treating you? Franz? Hey, have you told them everything? Not entirely. Same old you. Everything's a secret, yet you still want people to go out on a limb for you. There is no confirmation of what happened to our returned executor. We found an unknown string of virus in their suppressor chip during the inspection. The virus tried to infect the executor's orders database. Thankfully, we found it in time and isolated it. But as soon as it was discovered, it initiated a self-destruct sequence. We did not manage to discover its origins. Oh, is that true? You really lost your memories? We did a full inspection. There is evidence that someone wiped their memories. Aside from that, we find no abnormalities. Elric, could it be that incident from half a year ago? What are you talking about? I'm sorry. I will assign someone to get to the bottom of what happened to you. I hope it does not damage the trust between us. Don't catch your breath just yet, Archon. <clears throat> There's still another grave matter at hand. Eason, he's an engineer at the forward outpost and has been with us for six years. What about him? What? Eason? How sure are you about this, Franz? I checked the visitor's records. Eason just left the outpost lobby. The security records can show us his most recent route. Let's see what he has been up to. Activating Mimesis, reconstructing Eason's tracks. was trying to blow this place up a bomb keep going there might be more than one
We checked all the surveillance records on Eason and didn't find anything else. The lobby should be safe for now. However, we lack eyes on the outside of Hycros's dome. I just received word that the third bomb has been found there. Outside this large eggshell-like structure? plan here huh what am I supposed to do with this little thing back this is. I need to find him now. Franz, we failed. I used the chrono switch. Failed? You mean, you... Eason planted three explosives in the lobby and on top of the dome. I didn't manage to disarm them all in time. Well, can't get any worse than that. <laughs> Do you have the location of the explosives? I've uploaded the info to the database. Good. I'll have someone disarm the one in the lobby. You two take care of the one on the dome. It's over. It's all thanks to you. Not too shabby. Franz, what exactly happened with the chrono switch back there? Anyway, we shouldn't talk behind his back like this here. Now that everything's been resolved, I'm not needed here anymore. Don't worry. I'll explain the issues regarding the Omnium Towers to Paul. What about me? You? You have your work cut out for you. Listen, if I were you, I wouldn't trust everything they say. Just make sure you don't disappoint the Archon. You have a bright future ahead of you. Oh, I almost forgot. I have a gift for you. Go pick it up when you have the time. Head upstairs. You'll know it when you see it. Well then, I'm off. I'll leave you to it. Thank you for everything. You must have a lot of questions. Franz didn't explain it to you? He probably just wanted me to do the heavy lifting. I'm sorry. I'm unable to give you the answers right now. And it is not because I do not trust you. You have more than proven yourself in the bomb crisis. The fact of the matter is, time retracement is a sensitive subject and a closely guarded secret even within Hykros. I hope you understand. As for Zeke, Hykros will relay the latest intel to you via Franz and provide whatever assistance we can render. In exchange, I hope that you will help us solve the problems regarding the Omnium Towers and the heirs of Ida. Excellent. I still have matters to deal with in Parliament. So, this is where we part ways. I hope that you can live up to my expectations. I assure you, I will explain everything to you in due course. Verify. 
Verifying identity access level. Elric, access level 5. Plena, access level 4. Access level verified. You are allowed to proceed to Hykros, Parliament. to obtain any useful I I information did you find any other clues only some bad news the heirs of ida seem to be plotting something in the shadows was zeke's choice really worth it zeke is the victim here we must stop the heirs of ida's conspiracy yes i promised hykros that i would help them resolve this crisis oh and franz said he left me a gift i wonder what it could be Greetings, Cobalt B. Hmm. Who might you be? Franz asked me to pick something up from you. Franz? Yes, I remember now. Here's the Falcon he ordered from Banja's tech. It's yours now. Falcon? This is for me? This is the best that the Vehicle Research Department has to offer. I suppose. According to the manual, it runs on pure Omnium has carbon alloy body and magnetic brakes. 280 horsepower with a torque of 300. Speed up to 230. Oh, just 230? We might be able to increase the engine efficiency by 20% if we tune the transmission a bit. Or, uh, never mind. Well, it's not an easy vehicle to drive. Don't get too cocky before you're familiar with its capabilities. I'll be careful. Thank you, and goodbye. Don't mention it. I happen to have something to do at Hykros anyway, so it was no trouble. Let's test out the Falcon. Hello, Gerard. I'm heading back to Astra to find Franz. By order of the Archon, you have been granted permission to use the Hykro Space Rift, and are free to enter and exit as you wish. The records show that Franz's last destination was the Astra Space Rift. You might find him there. Safe travels. just explaining the situation to Paul. Hykros wants to shut down the tower, right? Yes. Archon Elric asked us to find a way to shut down the Omnium Tower, but what should we do exactly? Oh, Elric. Leaving such an important job to us. I've checked the internal structure of the Omnium Tower. It's a mess. It'll take some time to rearrange the energy pipeline. Oh, wow, Paul. You know how to stop it? Cut to the chase, Franz. If you have a way, just spit it out. 
Simply put, we need to find something called Astrum. Have you heard of it? Astrum? What's that? It's a kind of artificial omnium crystal and a very efficient energy storage medium. We need it to power the cooling system inside the omnium tower. But unfortunately, after the cataclysm, the technology to produce it was lost. It won't be easy to find a complete piece of Astrum. Luckily, I have some friends who deal with things under the counter. They shared some valuable information. There's a fighting competition held around here, and the organizer seems to have put up a piece of Astrum as the reward. A generous prize indeed. So you're saying we should try to win the competition? Well, you know I've said it before. Fighting really isn't my forte, so... Good luck with the Astrum hunting. Leave it to me. I'll win the competition. <laughs>